Good morning, Mayor and Council. My name is Emily Shinever. I am the Chief Executive Officer for the Austin Board of Realtors. Let me start just by saying that on behalf of our 14,000 members, I'd like to thank each of you for your continued public service, particularly during last week, as this has been a difficult time in our community and communities across the country. Today, I wanna to speak in favor of item 40, and I'm asking council to allocate $40 million towards rental assistance that is available for both tenants and landlords. Specifically, I would ask that you keep one to $2 million in the economic development department for small landlord assistance. After a certain date, if there were any unused funds remaining, those could be shifted to overall rental assistance. Over the past few weeks, we've heard experiences and anxiety from those that our military families currently stationed overseas who rely on each month's rent to maintain and pay their family home until they can return home to Austin. We've heard from families that are financially impacted by the COVID-19 pandemic who are concerned about how they're gonna pay next month's rent. We've heard from retired seniors who rely on their investment property income as their livelihood. We've heard from property owners who care about their tenants and are working with them to ease their financial hardships by waiving late fees and setting up individualized payment plans in ways that work for both sides. Sadly, we've also heard stories from property managers who are experiencing unresponsive and uncooperating tenants who are purposefully not paying rent, citing the council's 60 day grace period as the reason for doing so. These stories and experiences remind us that we are all in this together. We're also reminded that as a majority of the tenants are responsible and hardworking individuals, the same is, is so for the majority of landlords in our city. We're reminded that both sides need to not let a few bad apples spoil our bunch. That is why I respectfully ask the council to work to unite our community by allocating additional resources for rental assistance, assistance towards both tenants and landlords. Just as tenants shouldn't have to bear the brunt of the financial impact of this pandemic without similar relief and assistance options, neither should those small landlords. Thanks very much for your time and your public service during this crisis. Thank you. 